Best Ever Family Friendly Guitar and Music Education Expo. It's coming to uh, St. Louis, and it's part of the Cortex Innovation Community. To talk about it is Tom Salen. Tom, you are with Thos Custom Guitars? Correct. Thos Cor- Custom Guitars. Right? You got it. You are the owner as well as a woodworker. Correct. Well, that's, that's why you've gotten past the gatekeeper and we're allowed to talk wood. <laughs> you've per- You've brought with us, or brought with you, two different electric guitars correct handmade by you that is correct in one of the cases i actually helped take the tree down and processed all the wood myself so in one of them you took the tree down dried the wood cut it killed it milled it shaped it painted it stained it and it's sitting here every step of the process what kind of wood is it that's ash it was um right off of jameson road actually right (laughs) <laughs> see, see what I wanted to do with the ash trees from the arch grounds? Oh, grams? that's right. Yeah. That's right. Ash is a very hard wood. Baseball bats are made of ash. Yes, and a lot of guitars also. Is that right? Mm-hmm. How did you get into this? Well, I always wanted a certain guitar and just could not get my hands on it. So I made a guitar from a book that I bought at uh, some bookstore. Right. And it was okay. Uh, and then I made another one, and it got better. And then uh, after I got out of the service, I started uh, doing repairs on the kitchen table at night after work. And then I somebody asked me to build another one and then another one. And uh, finally, one caught uh, John McMurray, who owned McMurray Music uh, yeah. back in the day. Um, Somebody showed him one of my guitars, and he called me up and asked me if I wanted to come work down there. And so you've been doing it ever since. Yeah, pretty much. In some way, shape, or form. Okay, so it's not just woodworking. You also need to know electronics, too, I guess. That is correct. Yeah. Uh, the um, the neck, is that also made of the same tree, or is that different? No, that use uh, my own design of necks. I do laminates to help strengthen them and keep them from twisting. Uh, Plus, I think there's some tonal advantages to that. Yeah. Now, this is different than an an acoustic guitar, which takes the sound from the hollow inside. Correct. So this is a very different type of guitar. Mm -hmm. Is it as temperamental to changes in the temperature and the humidity as as acoustic guitars? uh, In some ways, yes. In some ways, no. Uh, You don't have the problems with the bodies moving around on electric guitars like you do on acoustics. Uh, but the necks are generally thinner and more subject to weather and humidity changes. Okay. Well, let me say, your guitars are, are beautiful. They're gorgeous. Thank do you, you custom make these for clients? I do. Uh, I If somebody calls up with uh, just some wild notion, I will work with them to build their dream. Uh, who are some of the people who have anybody famous used your guitars? No. Um, I've done work for some fairly large names in the business, but nobody is really playing my guitar on tour right now. Yeah, well, they should be. Yeah, uh, just, what, tell us about this thing coming up this weekend. The Tritone Expo. Uh, this is uh, Dave Anderson of Tritone Guitars Brainchild. Um, he wanted to get all the artisans in St. Louis together in one place so people could come see what they do. Uh, last year, it really exceeded our expectations. And so this year he's partnered with Michael Tomko and really expanded it. And now we've got uh, 40,000 square feet of interactive uh, exhibition, uh, drop-in lessons for preschoolers, uh, Extreme Institute is involved in it, and they're going to be doing beat-making classes. Uh, And, you know, this is a show that people can come down and get their hands on and really experience what is available. Uh, I can't say enough how St. Louis has all these hardworking artisans that are working to make beautiful music. Right, and so it's it's all um, instruments, it's not just guitars? Yes, there's acoustics, there's a custom drum builder coming in that lives here in town, um, acoustics, electrics, basses, uh, amp makers. What about uh, like violins and all that type of stuff? I don't know of any violin makers that are coming to the show this year. However, I don't have the complete list sure, of vendors. Sure, sure. But it's basically anybody who is an artisan who who makes uh, music or who makes instruments that make music 
and it's a show to showcase your wares. Correct. That's a great description. Uh, tell us about the finish on these things, because the finish mm-hmm. is magnificent. Well, uh, I actually mix up my own colors right. uh, from basic uh pigments right and apply them by hand and uh thank god i have a very patient and lovely wife Uh, (laughs) um bless you and then uh i use nitrocellulose lacquer which is a very traditional guitar finish is it sprayed on or hand rubbed uh the coloring is done by hand but the uh the clear coats are all sprayed on beautiful stuff uh what's the website to find out more uh, well, actually, Facebook, Thoughts Guitars. Okay. And then this is uh, both, uh, what, Saturday and Sunday? Is that right? That's right. 10, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Saturday and Sunday. It's the Tritone Expo at the uh, Cortex Innovation Community. Is there a website to find out more here? Yes, tritoneexpo.com. Tritoneexpo.com. Thanks for coming in. Thank okay. you for having 858 me. 858 KTRS. Ever wonder what the softest carpet on earth is? It's Smart Strand Silk by...